August 15, 2016. Today on Word of Inspiration, I shared the message, part two, the 10 P's of Joseph and fulfilling God's plan for your life. And part two was about the pit. And today we talked about what the pit was, that usually you don't get into the pit out of your own will. You're put in there because of the machinations of men. This happened to Jesus, it happened to David, and it did happen to Joseph. And the pit represents an area of fear, a situation of hopelessness, a place where it seems your dreams have come to an end. And the Bible tells us the pit was very dry and there was no water in it. There was no food, there was no water. And the pit therefore represents an area or a situation in your life of great financial distress. Um, it could also be a place of great um, difficulty with your health. But in Psalm 40, David shares his experience of the pit. He said, I cried unto the Lord. I waited patiently and he heard my cry. And he delivered me out of an horrible pit and he set my feet upon a rock and he established my goings and he put a new song into my mouth, even praised unto our God. So the summary of today's message, if you're going through a pit experience, just look up because when you look down in the pit, you're just going to see soil. But when you look up, you see the clear blue skies and you see God and his power. I will lift up my eyes onto the hills from whence comes my, my strength, my help. My help comes from the Lord and God will deliver you. And like he did for Joseph, he took him out of the pit and he set him upon a rock and put praise in his mouth. He took him to part of his house and from there to prison. But then finally he became prime minister. So get ready to experience something really good, even though you're going through a pit experience. And if you're already in a pit experience and you've gone through it, just praise him. God bless you.